Hello and welcome to today's tech tip. Today we're going to be reviewing the deselect function from the programming browser. You can see I've got a very large program here with a lot of circle measurements, some probe moves, a lot of surface measurements, some trim checks. I got everything all mixed up here. Now let's say I just wanted to delete um, just my circle measurements and I wanted to keep everything else. Well, even though they're all spread out here, deleting them one at a time would take a while. So, you know, the easy thing here is to go up to the segment level there, up to the name, right click, and I would say select, and go and select all of my circles. And we will just go to circles and select all. Okay, and then so it highlights all the circles and then I could just right click on any of these ones that are selected and delete them. But that's not what I actually want to do. I want to delete everything else. I want to keep my circles and delete everything else. So how do I do that? Well, the easiest way to do it is to use the deselect command. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to highlight everything. You're just using the shift key. You can see I've selected the entire segment. And now from any one of these features in here, I'm just going to right click and you can see we've got the whole segment commands and you'll see here it says select, but it says shift to deselect. So hold the shift key down. So I'm going to go back to my circles again. I'm going to say all, but I'm going to hold the shift key down while I select the word all click. Okay. And you can see now as I scroll through all of my circle measurements are now unselected. They are deselected. So now I can click on anything else and just say delete. And now I have all of my circle measurements remaining using the deselect function in the programming browser. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.